Last weekend, Jenny Slatton spoke with an immigration lawyer. She wanted to know if Sumit could immigrate to the United States with her. The lawyer acknowledged that there might be questions about the legality of the marriage. Jenny Slatton and Sumit Singh were learning Bollywood dancing. They attended classes with Jenny's daughter Christine and her daughter-in-law Jen. According to them, it was one of their most fun outings. Sumit admitted that he is a little slower to master dance moves than he used to. He is now a grown man in his 30s, he works almost every day. And he's not as good a dancer anymore as when he and Jenny first became a couple. Sumit told everyone that he would not just have to go back to work, he will have to see his family. The last time he saw his parents was when he and Jenny announced they were getting married. They didn't show up for one last attempt at a family reunion. Christine surprised Sumit with her offer to go to them and meet his family in person. Later, Jenny had a secret meeting with an Indian immigration lawyer to bring Sumit to America. Now he is not even considering the possibility. Instead, Sumit cites his attachment to his toxic family as the reason. But what would the process entail if he changed his mind? The lawyer asked Jenny, are you a virgin in the United States? She didn't understand what that meant at first. The major question by the immigration department will be why a lady 64-year-old is married to a guy who is only 33 or 34 years old, the lawyer warned. I understand that there is a big age gap between us, Jenny admitted, but we've been together for 10 years. She recalled, first we had to go through proving our love to Sumit's parents and now we have to continue doing it for immigration. Jenny noted, I mean, we've stayed together this long, there's a reason for it, obviously we love each other. The lawyer had another warning for Jenny. Sumit would need a police certificate before immigration for a criminal background check. There's a nasty catch. Sumit's relatives can file a formal complaint about his marriage. This could stop any visa process at the root. Thanks for watching, guys. Please consider liking this video and subscribing to my channel if you like the content, and see you in the next video.